about liquor obviously from the title right <laughs> but before we get into that i want to make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel so if you are new here be sure to subscribe to my channel and thank you so much for clicking on this video don't forget to hit the bell right next to the subscribe button so you know every time i post a video and if you are yet again clicking yet another one of my videos you are just the best because i truly appreciate you for the real loyal support and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up because why not? You are going to love it. Join the TJ fam for sure, guys. Subscribe right now. Don't wait. Go right now. All right, guys. Of course, let's get into the video. This video, of course, is about, as you can see, liquor. This is my first time ever having this liquor. And, of course, it's half empty. And I thought before it goes away and it is completely gone i want to do a youtube video on it and let the world know what i think about this liquor so get your get your glasses get your coins together because you got to try this this liquor out i'm telling you i'm not lying besides that my skin is on point like this is exactly what self-care looks like okay <laughs> this is oh my skin looks wonderful goodness gracious jesus christ i love myself okay i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry back to it and see what are we talking about today guys we are talking about knob creek okay let me take this green thing off so you guys can see it like for real for real see it knob creek the licks the licks you see it yes this is the liquor that we are talking about today i'm gonna tell you guys if you can or cannot drink this straight and i'm gonna talk about if you need to mix it with something and what to mix it with okay <laughs> so that is what we're going to be talking about again i'm not going to send y'all off and act like i know the background of knob creek because yeah i don't so <laughs> i'm just going to talk about the flavors of it and what i think of it okay of course i'm a whiskey. okay guys if you know me you know that i am a whiskey girl and i gotta talk about whiskey i'm normally doing the basics i go for jameson of course as always because that's the greatest I don't know. I love Jameson so much. But we're talking about Knob Creek today. And I am going to say that Knob Creek is very pleasing for me as a whiskey girl. Okay? <laughs> so, get your glasses together, guys. And let's get the drinking. All right, guys. Here we go. This is the whiskey. This is literally the whiskey plane, okay? It smells so good. Whiskey smells amazing to me. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I love the way this smells. All of them, all of them. So let's see what it tastes like, guys. Let's check it out. Ooh. Woo! That was pretty good, though. I'm not even gonna lie, that was pretty good. I still feel it going down. Like, it's like right up in here right now. It's still going down my body. I feel a little bit sad. It's still moving. But it was perfect. Like, I didn't feel any kind of like burning, sensational, spicy, or anything like that. It went down so perfect. Like, so smooth, so perfect. When I say y'all, whiskey is the S H I T. It is the S H I T. Okay? Whiskey, go, whiskey goes down so perfect and you would look up and you didn't have about seven shots because it goes down so smooth and you look up like oh am i effed up am i drunk <laughs> and you be drunk <laughs> yeah i love whiskey so much it's like the greatest thing ever so we're now next thing we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and talk about how whiskey tastes with pineapple juice so again i'm gonna use my handy dandy my lovely this is the time now i want to show you guys what it looks like with pineapple juice how much pineapple juice you probably want to put in it to still get the flavor of whiskey i ain't saying that you drink pineapple juice with your whiskey i ain't saying that but i tried it the other day with the bacardi gold and the rum i drank it the other day with that and i thought ooh, <laughs> okay that's what i did Ooh. 
because it was so good. Like I thought, oh, okay, let me tell the world. Let me tell the world. They, they might be asleep. Let me wake them up. Let me wake them up. So we're going to try this out with the pineapple juice. Okay, that's the liquor, that's the liquor. And guess what, straight out the can. Don't call me ghetto, y'all, don't call me ghetto. I might be, a little bit. But I'm pouring it straight out the pineapple can, okay? Let's see what it tastes like. You know what? It's not that bad. And you know why? I think it's not that bad. Because pineapple juice is <laughs> fire all by itself. And whiskey is fire all by itself. Okay. <laughs> so imagine you double taking it with fire and fire and putting it together. Boom. You getting magic. Okay. This is magic. You probably. Mm, it is a little sweet to it. So if you don't really. You don't want your whiskey to be sweet. I recommend you not do this. I think that if you on a, I would recommend this to ladies. Like if you chilling, like in the house on a regular weekday, you have to work in the morning. You got to work in the morning. You have to just work this morning and you can't, you you don't want to get effed up. Go ahead and pour some pineapple juice in it. And you, Cause you definitely had a long day. And you don't even know why you need some real hard ass liquor. Go ahead and pour some pineapple juice in it because it's the truth. The truth, the truth. Um, I will say that Knob Creek is a, in the middle of not inexpensive, inexpensive. It's right there in the middle. So you pay for what you get, okay? Now, this is the truth, though. This is the truth. I like it. It's real chill. It makes it, it makes it, the taste of it, it gets, it makes it a little girly, a little feminine. And you still need your whiskey in it, though. You still hitting that whiskey, though, okay? So don't get it twisted. So next we're gonna do, we're gonna taste the whiskey with the Coke. All right, beautiful queens and kings. This is the last one that I'm doing for you guys. This is the Nine Creek with the Coke. Well, not Coke. Obviously I love Coke because I keep saying it, but it's Pepsi. I got Pepsi right now, okay? Get a little splash of this Nine Creek, okay, okay. Okay, let me prove to y'all that I got Pepsi. For real, for real. This is, I got Pepsi. Even though I keep saying Coke, I love Coke. Coke tastes so much better than Pepsi. I'm not even lying. But I got Pepsi right now. So we're going to talk about what it tastes like with Pepsi. And which one would I prefer? I'm going to beep it out. Woo! That was hidden. Of course, that was hidden. We all know that dark pop and dark liquor goes lavishly together. So, that's a yes. So, I love all three of them. I can't really say which one I like the best because I feel like I got different vibes for all three of them. If I'm trying to turn up, I'm shotting it. And we're going we gonna to take five or six shots to the whiskey. And we're going to turn up and we're going to have fun. But if I'm trying to chill and I know I just had a long ass day, but I'm not trying to be effed up. And I got to work in the morning again, do the same thing again tomorrow. I'm going to go ahead and probably drop some pineapple juice in it, chill it out, humble it a little bit, make it a little bit sweet for your girl or whatever. And chill out with that and watch a little movie, probably a Real Housewives or something, you know. <laughs> and I'm going to chill out with that. But if I want to, if it's the weekend, I'm probably painting or I'm probably pre-gaming or something like that or I'm trying to feel good. I'm probably going to drop the Coke or the Pepsi in it just to turn up. Probably take a shot or whatever or two. But I'm probably going to turn up with the... Um, this actually, well, That would probably be my go-to with the Coke and the Pepsi with the brown liquor. Because why not? If not that, I'll probably be doing cranberry juice. But I don't want to waste my cranberry juice because I love drinking that in the morning. If you did not know, cranberry juice is my favorite juice of all time. <laughs> and I drink it every single morning and it makes me feel wonderful. But anyways, guys... That is my thought process on the Knob Creek and the three different types of how you can make it and mix it and make yourself feel amazing. And you know what? As you know it, I'm Tara J, guys. <laughs> Peace.